All right, one owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com. And I'm going to do a bit of a look at the comments and stuff like I've been doing. I can't even, look at this. I've got stinking 99 plus. I had over 500 messages. It's my birthday, 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 birthday. And so I thank everybody who posted. I don't know. In fact, I posted kind of a thing right here that, wow, over 400 birthday messages between Facebook, YouTube, email, text. Thank you, guys. I had the best birthday I possibly could. No cake, no party, just a big fat fucking bud, a few fanfuls of vitamins, a trip to the gym, and a few turkey tacos. Yeehaw! But at the auction with Dad and Breeder for the day, best time I could ever hope to have. Well, except for this one girl. Sorry, Dad. So there's the whole deal there. And what is that? I don't know what that is. That's I don't know how that got in there. And then there's that. That was at the auction. Kind of a cross between an Acker NSX and a Testarossa type of a replica type thing. And there's Breeder in the back seat at the auction. And she's just so happy to be with us. Official vehicles. They had these there 237 freaking miles on the things. Brand new 16s. Nice SL there. I fell in love. Manual 4.2 liter V8 with 48,000 miles on this S4 wagon. Yeah. I had a hard time not buying that car. What is that? I don't know. So, that's the Facebook thing. And I'm, I'm going to try to look. So, like, there's all these posts for my birthday to answer. And then I can click this. See, 223 more. Okay. Well, you click it. And it's all well and good. Except it only shows 10 at a time. I'm going to have to scroll and click this 21 fucking times to try and get all the way to the bottom. So I'm going to do that, and I'm going to try to post. I mean, I appreciate everybody taking the time to... Look at there. Look how well people know me. Jacob Binnick, he even sent me a package. I've got to do a subscriber review type thing because he sent me a something that we're going to try out. In fact, I might try it with my dad today and do a video there. Um, I don't know. We shall see. We shall see. Man, I'll tell you what, just the number of people. I'm not going to take up your time doing this. I'll take up my time doing it. Look at Christina Fisher and Marcus Fisher. They went to in and out and Randy's and everywhere down here. In fact, he came and bought an, two SLs. I don't know. That sucker's supposed to buy my 6.9. I need to get a hold of him. I'm going to do that right now. So, if you're in Germany, by the way, for... I know he's detailing and sells classics. Like, this is what he just got in. There's a lot of SLs. So, we're going to have to talk to him in a minute. Okay, so, I'm going to go ahead and scroll down a little bit and take up, you know, the last week or so. And it's going to go, I'm going to go over some of the comments. Um, I put up a video about comments, and it sat in here for a week before I could get it uploaded. I'm doing lots of videos now. Um, I'm back into a little bit of a swing of things um, as far as updates go. I've got some new help coming. I don't know how long they will work for, and I don't know how well we will work out, be me with him or them with me or whatever. Um, I just know that someone's coming out. And we're going to be doing some stuff, and we'll see what we'll see what happens. We will see what happens. Okay, so now this isn't just about. I put in the titles of these a lot, troll comments and bad people and screw them, stuff like that. Not really, but that's kind of the gist. And it's not like that at all. I mean, there is some people on here that are super nice and help out and make some very nice comments. And I appreciate those. I am very thankful to know people here on YouTube and have people commenting on these videos. Um, yeah, plain and simple. Okay, I'm going to, and see, I don't answer enough questions. I don't have time. We'll start here. That guy's going to do a thing for gas mileage. I didn't do it. Damn it. I just didn't do it. I did. It was too hard. Nathan in a Ford t shirt. Man, it was like, yeah, it's $2.99 on clearance. Yeah, buddy. Uh, Tracy Saunders, man, I appreciate all the comments and talking back and forth here. You too, RV GoFundMe. And he likes the idea of doing a three-week three week max on the worker. You know, and if they don't work out, great, whatever. Um, looking forward to seeing the new employee, how he or she does with everyday running, the workings. 
Scooby Doo. I can't reply to him. If I reply, I can put blah, 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 and I can try and reply. It won't post it no matter what I do. And there's a couple of you like there out there that if you're not getting replies from me, that's why. See, and um, tall dude Matthew, I've known you forever, man. You took a whole fucking hour and a half to polish a car, wash the car. Yeah, whatever. Windows had a fuse. Yeah, it was a f on my Wagoneer, and it probably was a fuse or a relay. Don't hire anybody till I talk to you. Man, squeaky wheel gets the grease, man. I'm sorry. I got this guy that's coming, and maybe we'll have a compound, and we'll have two or three people come. I don't know. You're awesome, dude. I know, right? If only the ladies thought so now. <laughs> Thanks for watching, James, and everybody. You know, it's cool. Your cars are by far sexier, better and sexier than the trucks. Well. When are you going to do more videos blasting? all those haters in the comment section that's the best doing one right now you're in it and he was it was bad hey so i went over this let's scroll up yeah one of my strangest subs guy's got seventy one thousand subscribers but his videos barely break two thousand views i know i know oh wow i missed it i don't know if you're teaching something to the young guy or you are not or you or not but you're a little bossy, I'm the boss, and kind of disrespectful the way you talk to him. You kind of come off as a dick. Dude, this is six months into working with some, with Nick, actually. Five, oh, five, I'm sorry, five months of it, and I really don't give a shit how I come off after the fuck-ups that happened way back then. Serial Marshmallows, dude, you are a dick. If I was a kid, I'd put a whooping on your ass so quick your fucking head would spin. Any time you feel froggy, Jump off your fucking lily pad, bitch. Right. The froggy? Jump on off your lily pad, bitch. Fuck. Like I've been selling cars all my life and I never fucking been to a bar, got in a bar fight and fucking Oh man. We made a run for the border when we were like 15, 16. We go over there and drink because it's legal. You get fucking fights, have to run for the border so you don't get put in a Mexican jail. I don't care what anybody says. You're funny as hell. I'm laughing my ass off. Good. Thank you. Sell those clam stains with your money. Move up to the high-end cars. 10 to 20 years old. Love every episode. Man, my clam stains are good cars. And I kind of have a niche. A niche. Tab tastes awesome. Diet Coke, but better. I miss commenting on some things. How many cars you own? I am down to over 100 now. First, bitches, check out Cigar Obsession. I really don't want to see an old half-naked man. I had a, um, I have no idea why your worthless ass still hangs around, except for the fact that you obviously have no life whatsoever. What a cunt you are. This guy just comments on all my stuff. Can't afford a proper t-shirt? What's wrong with you? Give me your address and I will send you one. You make good videos about cars, man, but make it professional or let it be. Okay, okay, if that'll do it for you, chat. My address is in every video, but here you go. Hey, dude, dude sent me a t-shirt. <laughs> I think he did. I really do. I think he ordered me a V8 t-shirt. <laughs> well, Robert, if you're watching this and that's you, that's funny. And I'm just going back and forth here, man. Everybody, I get people just want to fucking bust my balls and give me a hard time. And fucking, you know, whatever. I, I'm I'm doing what I'm doing, and like, so yeah, I, I'm I've been trying to get my tan going a little better because I because I've been working out and I feel good about the way I fucking feeling and looking, and I'm gonna get a little tan on this white farmer tan body. <laughs> it's him! It's him! I got a reply. I'm making a video now. A video now. You are in it and such should be up in a week a week was it a v8 t 
t-shirt? If so, I got it. And we'll do a review. Sorry to make you live through this here. I had no clue where it came from. Okay, well, that's what I'm going to put. Funny shit, man. Oh, you talk to your GPS the same way I do. Yeah, I, I, I don't like that bitch. Yeah, I was talking bad about raptors. Yeah. Where'd this go? Hang on. We're going to... Cheap ass fucking people, seriously? Cheap ass fucking people, seriously? LOL on a swap meet video? Wow. Yeah, cheap ass people, it's a swap meet. You're a cunt, fuck you. LOL, I died laughing, that's cool. That chick was so fucking rude and entitled. See, look, and this is on a road trip video. I get hate for road trip videos. Thanks for another great video, Nathan. Always enjoy everyone. These are especially interesting to watch for people like myself from overseas Scotland. And I get a lot of comments like that who can't easily get the opportunity to experience an American road trip. It's great to sit back and watch spectacular scenery you drive through. It's cool. You feel like you've been on a road trip, blah, 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 blah. And I don't know, swinging in. Yeah, there was some bitch in there swinging in out of the lanes for fuck's sakes. But thanks, Russell. And I enjoy connecting with people on videos like that and if you don't like them don't watch them american traveling road trip usa road trip right in the thing it's pretty fucking obvious what the video is going to be about if you don't want to watch it it's pretty simple to just not click that button i made this bigger oh ooh, ooh, not that big oh my Okay, that should do it. <laughs> ah, okay. And I talked about the plastic spray paint one. This guy's a damn fool. If you do what he's saying and have a decent car, it will be shitted out. You're a fucking moron. And you're a fucking jackass. Why, thank you. Then coming back and watch it again, make me a nickel. And this one. I know you. You, Boca. Yeah, 67 tube. Nathan, you have a unique way of handling people on the phone. I think I went over this one. I know for sure that person who was looking at the black Mercedes found your call at least a little bit awkward after you hung up. I don't care. And you can watch the other comment video about it. And when people. Yeah, see, I did. I explained it all. Blah, blah, blah. You can read this one in the road trip video. And it has nothing to do with the road trip, but whatever. Very dangerous cars. The wheels fall off. Congrats. You get the dunce cap for the day. 97 Lincoln Town Car. The wheels fall off. Yeah, if you're an idiot, you don't put them on right, maybe. Nathan, the spokesman of American Road. I don't know why the white P71s have that peeling problem, but they sure the fuck do. Too much fucking wax, asshole. It's polish. But, no, I didn't have enough. And ran out. <laughs> this will get some other idiot coming. You ran out because you used too much, idiot. Love to work for me. Lives close by. Man, you got to get a hold of me and stuff. Her ass wasn't tatted. Your video sucks. And you are a cunt. Nice to meet you. Why do you YouTubers run your flaps with see much useless dribble? Shut up and get it done already. Jeez.
Oh man, Nathan, you're offering a hell of a good job. I am too. I really, really am. Feel my pain on the Wagoneer back window. Yeah. Yeah. Mostly junk. Mostly junk. Okay. Well, I just sold one of that piece of junk for 10 grand. Sold one for seven grand. Sold one for 17 grand. So I I kind of like my junk. That's sick. Total throwback. Yeah, the Nintendos. Yeah, because they're selling them. They're like $500 now. And they're only 60 bucks at Walmart, but Walmart ran out. Okay, um, the good ones are right up here. There's this guy again. I wouldn't buy a car from this loser. This place looks like a junkyard. Probably one of those fly-by-night guys. Yeah, I've been around for fucking 30 years. You'll buy a car there, and the next day the fucking engine will blow, and he'll be gone with your 500 bucks. You know what? The only cars I sold for 500 bucks had blown-up motors, I think. <laughs> fucking idiots. Did I answer him? Hey, you are a moron that still made me a nickel watching. <laughs> Get a life, Chachi. Oh, man. I gotta take this car. Hello? Hello? Hi. Happy Thanksgiving. Oh, yeah. You too. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, there's some time today you can come over to eat? I don't know. If you guys are done doing your stuff or something, whenever. I don't care. I gotta do my laundry. So I'm going there to pick up from now and switch it. So like after okay, three or um, something, probably. What now? Anytime after three or something, whenever you guys are free, whatever, I don't know, or nothing. It okay. doesn't matter. I don't care. I, I know. I thought um, I'm going to put a turkey breast in the oven. Um, and I think it should be ready maybe about four. Okay. Does that sound good? Okay. All right. I love you. Okay, I love you. See you then. Bye. Bye-bye. I'll get to hell because I was mean there. I don't really talk to my mom much, and it's Thanksgiving, and, like, I usually make it a point to be gone. In fact, we haven't talked in a year since September that much. Um, but Thanksgiving, and I guess I've got to head up there. So I'm going to make that happen. Okay. I feel the ladies are attracted to you, even the one that argued with you. Holy hell, I sure hope so. That'd be cool. Wow. Wow. I wish. Wait, who had all this stress? I bet that needy woman last week who had all the stress and tension in her from last week, she would let you pound her brains out sexually. <laughs> ah, it's so funny. Yeah. Ah. Yes, the other lady in the phone calls video, what a sweet, polite lady on the phone. She was so cool, and I took 10 minutes probably wasting my life talking to her because I wanted to help her out. She had a Cressida with like, 27,000 original miles or something. See, that's cool. This guy's a dealer. It's cool to hear from people like that. You have to be the only person on YouTube who has tutorials on polishing rust. Can't wait for the GTA detail and stuff. Hit the rust rubbing pot down. Polish, polish the crap out of it. Yeah, you can polish anything. Just make it look as good as you can. And there's something. Wow, that's your mom? No hug, no kiss, no I love you, ma? The nerve in kids these days without manners. Wow. You are a time-sensitive male brought to you a bunch of stuff and you don't even need, and she wasn't even greeted as the queen she is. Wow.com. With my life, jag off. I actually don't talk to my mom very much. I was surprised that we talked that much. First time I've seen her in six months, and she didn't have to bring it. My dad was meeting me later. Thanks for your concern, but you will notice you don't see her in the videos much. They don't concern themselves with my channel or life in general. And it's just the way it is, and there's more and whatever. It's just the way it is. It's not, it's my personal life. It's kind of, everybody's got the shit that they've got. You know, what am I going to say? What other car guy travel channels? Sometimes.
it is progressing smoothly, probably especially because I am by myself. And glad to see you back, Bryn. Brendan, he sent me the tab dispenser for the napkins. That was very cool. I'm not a pro, but I don't think you're supposed to end up with color on your pad unless there is a colored wax. Another thing is that his buffer seems to be a direct drive and not a dual action. He should warn people that amateurs probably use a DA because an amateur with his buffer will probably create havoc. You obviously know nothing about paint or buffing, and yes, people who are witless should just pay to have it done. Yeah. Sure. And dude, I, I had so many people trying to get a hold of me on the job, and I got a guy coming out. We shall see. I should keep the excursion. It's a great traveling buddy car. Another great video, Nathan. I just do not get anyone that gives you hate for any of your videos. The way I look at it is this. We as subscribers are all really very luckily, lucky to be allowed into your life like this. And whether it is a video about cars, I think we will all probably agree that that's what initially brought us to you as a high proportion of us. Whether it be a meatloaf making video, and I liked that one. I really did. Going to the gym, supermarket shop, work vlog, swap meat, visit, auction, road trip, blam, 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 variety, spice of life, or spice of the meatloaf. I love getting comments like this and talking to people, and I don't have enough time to answer them, and I need to answer it more. And I don't know, Russell. Is it Russell McFarland? I don't know. And see, and all the usernames get me messed up. Because I know people on Facebook, too. Dude, thank you. Making a video now praising on that. Much appreciated. The whole capital thing messed me up. Please message me Facebook. Sorry, I'm going to do this here because I appreciate it. Boom. Always wear safety goggles. Never do this without safety goggles. Doesn't have any on and continues to work. Amazing how children in this day and age are so fucking stupid and this sort of comment just goes over their head. No life experience and shitty parenting to a bunch of entitled twats. No doubt. I didn't have them. I'm doing the job. I'm old school. I do my work. I watch out and be careful. But at the same time, I'm going to tell you guys, hey, wear goggles and don't do it without it. I don't have them on. I was kind of making a and showed that I didn't have them on. I'm getting this a lot now. Somebody makes a comment with a link somewhere and then they click it with 49 likes and have somebody comment is excellent. It's total spam. Piece of shit junk car. Should have took it to the junk's yard. Worth more in parts. A 25,000 mile GTA. Yeah. <laughs> and no shit. I don't know why. No clue. Sucks. Actually, I just seen a that exact truck go for twenty five hundred bucks. Nice one, too. Almost bought it. God, quit doing that. Here's another guy that's been to the auction that I go to. 
Five hundred dollar car, ninety two Buick Roadmaster with like under a hundred in your wettest dream. I could buy a better vehicle for this price. For what price? There's no price in my fucking videos. The tonneau is shot, and the engine has over a hundred k. It had a hundred and ten, I think, hundred and five. It was probably granny driven and caused some damage. Vin, these trannies are expensive and not worth replacing junk. Besides, you probably purchased this car for this amount using the same reason I stated because you're a vulture. You're a fucking moron. I know shit about cars, pricing classics, or even why these are cult classics that they call classics they are. Either way, it was sold in a week, three to five years ago. Get a life, Chachi. There's this guy again. And there's this guy again. Why do you put the car in reverse? And everything? Because it helps you with the brakes. It helps you know the tranny and know how it's going. And I'm hoping I didn't go over too much of this in the last video. You're wasting your time. The pants already did. It's oxidized. And I can't watch no more reason to put wax in a compound on rust. Are you fucking kidding me? You actually censored yourself? You fucking jag off. Yes, thanks for telling everybody that the car's been painted, idiot. Like I wouldn't. Shave the beard, man. Get a life, Chachi. Keep up the good work. The only person that still uses Google Glass. I don't know anybody else who ever used it. See? More of the spam. You were getting flagged. Fasten your goddamn seatbelt. No. I don't hear the damn near. Is that a Star Trek ring? Not cool, dude. Disco sucks. What a more. Is that a used car dealer's ring? That is a real choker. What an idiot. Yeah, I've got a fucking cool ring. When I sold my first million bottles of vitamins, I fucking had this ring made like I wanted it. Fuck it. It's funny watching you in public. You scope out all the ass. I do it for you, the viewer. Nothing too much for you guys. See there? I like that GS300 was really clean. The CTS are rare in a manual, but every time I see them, they're rough. Go figure. Man, I will be having a GS300 pretty soon. Why does this have so many views? Because it is like me. Bad ass. And see, you can come to Germany, you can have a nice room apartment for me, and you can buy and sell cars. See, dude, there's some nice people I've met on here. This dude is walking like an elephant. Thought they were having an earthquake for a minute. It's an elephant. Oh, yeah, fucking twat. I have bad ankles, and I'm lucky I can even do what I do. And I'm not supposed to walk so much, and I'm supposed to have surgery on my fucking leg, and I'm not gonna. I don't do that kind of shit. So. Fuck you, that's how I'm walking. This guy is a comedic genius. Clearly not a serious video. My DIY engine. What am I supposed to do? Stop scratching it, asshole! If there's a chip in the paint, I scratch on a little. My dad had one of these 10 years. It was so bouncy. Yeah, I fucked her too. Your mother, right? <laughs> and so I got guys trolling people on my videos. And he started in here. Yeah, this guy came along at this time. Tell me, Dad, his car looks awesome. Sure will. Okay, I'm going to go get my laundry done and come back. And You never said what year the car is, dumbass. Get a life, fuckwit. Hum, is that a description of cereal marshmallows? Hum, is that a description of your balls, you dickless fuck? Yeah, that's what it is. Look at how many of these 98 likes on that comment. I would never let this cloud detail my car. You and your car are far beneath me, cunt. No one offered get alive. Serial masturbator, the only thing beneath you is your vagina. <laughs> yeah, Beavis. What's wrong with the rear wheels, Billy Bob? Watch the rear wheel video shit for brains. 
You're so lucky to have your dad still alive, Nathan. Make every day the best ever. Your biggest fan. Dude, I love my dad, and I, we went to the auction for my birthday. Oh, here we go. This guy is a junkie. He looks like he is on drugs, and he sells anything from puppies to cars. What a scum. You are for sure a junkie piece of shit. I really hope your life improves. And I don't know if you're going to be able to see this because as I block and people block. There you go. Yeah. He is a wannabe tough guy because he's on a bike and because he approached a reporter. I was hating on one of your other videos because you were annoying and looked like a massive stoner. Buddy, do your kids a favor and lose some weight. This might be a stupid question, but is that properly cycle tank? How long did it take you to... I think this is what happened to my Pearl Garami. Kid keeps saying that's unacceptable. Blah, 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 when he's eight years old, blah, blah. You're a loser, hick hillbilly. Language is terrible. Forget that. Really? Walmart doesn't give a fuck about their animals. What a loser with nothing better to do with her life. Such a cute girl, K. No graves. You stinking. This guy's on drugs. Look at his eyes. Is this everybody's on drugs? You, dude, you must be on drugs. Quotes, they like to be able to see through the water. You know, he's just a pretentious little entitled fucking piece of shit. Nigger Rob, nigger fuck Rob. It's all about Sasha Banks. Fuck Rob. Really? I don't even know who, what. Fuck the KKK. Dumbasses. Well, yeah, I can agree with that. But what a pathetic bitch for posting her whole life on here and not even bother to respond to comments like the card. What an idiot. Here you go. How do you smoke this stuff? For honeycomb scrape. So you're smoking fucking... Yeah, you fucking idiot. Yo, that white bimmer is clean as fuck though, right? Are you wearing a Rolex? Spoiled rich mother... No, you fucking loser. You can get anything you like and... My nigga got to take his first bump in front of Booker T. Really? Really? I know you guys like to enjoy life, but please watch your cholesterol. I always eat out, too. Doctor said my cholesterol. Oh, you're 26 and you're this fucking stupid? You fucking entitled little millennial piece of shit. This account gets 30 cents per view. 30, 33 million in my bank about a week ago. Right. Right. What an idiot. Watching that piece of duty prank. I can hear porn in the background. You're just such a wag job. All right. <clears throat> Back with you here. And I'm going to go ahead and go over here to Facebook where I clicked a bunch of stuff. I got my laundry done and stuff. 22 more posts. So I've clicked this 20 times or so. Watch this. Wait, where did it go? Why did it jump? Stupid thing. Click. Wait. 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 Ten more. So then you gotta and now it gets soup it's super slow right now. And then it's twelve more. And so we're gonna have to wait and wait and wait and wait and wait. And wait, oh, there, and wait, and wait for it. No, it still won't even move. Come on. Did I miss it? Uh, no, two more posts. Okay, so I'm to the bottom. Now I'm going to go back up and I'll like all these posts. Because it does mean something to me that people took the time to do it. So, you know what? When this thing clicks me out of here to somewhere else, because God, wait, wait, boom. Not cool. Not cool at all. So, most of all, this takes time. I like that shirt. I'm no guy in colleges, but I know a cut when I see one. Fuck. 
clicky wait. So this is going to take a while. I'm not going to read. Okay, let me scroll up. Like. Hey, it did it. Yeah. I missed this guy. Like. Ooh, that did it quick. It took a long time for it to be ready, but it did it quick when it got there. Thank you. Like. 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 Now, I've actually had people come and get mad at me because I don't reply on what they send me. Well, especially on a day like this. You know what? You just can't. There's 230 something just here on Facebook, man. So, not going to happen. Jeez, man. I mean, it's just there's an insane amount. And I guess the problem is it takes so long. Now, I could have liked them as the day went on, but I wasn't around the computer all day. Well, I like that. How can you not like that? If I missed you here, I am so sorry. Never my intent. I really am trying. This is proof of such, I guess. And I'll be trying to make sure and finish it the minute I get done with this video, finishing up everything. On the comments. So that's that. Back to the comments. This guy commented, I need a Mercedes C200 in parts. I was going to put, use that one for parts. <laughs> that's mean. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm junkie. You sure are a junkie piece of shit. I showed what he says. Tony Montana, LOL, coming from someone who calls himself Tony Montana. Ah, fucking kid. No joke, Dr. Green Thumb. Huh? You make no sense. That is my nickname, you goof. Is Allah Akbar your name? LOL freak. What do you call yourself? Allah Akbar? That's not even a noun. I mean, are you serious? You're dealing with the dumbest scum of broke fucks in your used cars laughing my ass off. What is that? A 97 to 2001 Benz laughing my ass off. Ha 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 ha. You're a moron. Take a look at your life. You are absolute scum of the earth. How am I scum? I don't post videos of what I blew. So how do you even have a clue? LOLOL, you fucking geek. All I had to do is look at your post, you fucking idiot. Am I getting to you? No, actually, you're making me a little bit of a teeny bit of teeny bit of revenue. You're actually making shit up like a kid would. Bro. No, not at all. How old are you? You're 26, I think, if I remember right. Oh, wait, you're probably thinking right now, I'm not your fucking bro. Ha, ha, ha. You're done, bud. Yeah, I'm done. Look at this. Just little chocolate one is cute as can be, eh? Yet you grab her by the skin like some gangster with no life, then claim the dog is cute as can be. You know what? You're handicapped mentally. I'm just pointing shit out. Proof you're a dumbass. Do you even know what illiterate means? <laughs> Dude, you do not want to learn how. I mean, oh. I actually responded too much, just wasting time. And you know, nice to do about what is at the auctions, but what kind of prices are those Tahoe's and pickups going through? It's hard to say. I mean, we got stuff that ranges 60,000 miles in. Basically, you're, I don't think he's going to answer that question. Remember, he's a dealer. No, I'll answer the question. It's just far too vague. Dealers make zero to 30,000 sale. But that's crazy talk. Yeah, he was talking, uh, and nothing against it. He was talking, you know, the motor alone is worth more than five grand in the uh, trucks that are going through. Well, yeah. If basically, if you're going to spend 20 grand on a truck, it's probably going to go through for 14. I'm sorry to tell you, you're a hoarder. 
because I went to a swap meet. I might be, but that's a whole different thing. <laughs> no, I'm a seller, buddy. <laughs> this is not cool, spade nor jack of hearts. Stressed out Nathan must freaking get some or else lose the plot. Shit happens, Nate. Your beagles, I bet, are nervous. What happened to one old car guy? He got famous. One old car guy was so charming, like the actor that we all know he sounds like. And yet now the uncouth verbal bashing demon, Ryan, would be so sad. I don't have time to answer these. I mean, it's just what a fucked heart. I feel sorry for some of these people. And this guy actually can No wonder nobody wants to work for you. You're a better male homosexual getting paid minimum wage to deal with an asshole. People get way more minimum wage around here. I'm glad I got a college degree and make some weight more than you. You sell fucking flooded lemons, a true typical Jew car salesman. Watch it. Spray it. Pathetic. Dude. Yeah, I've sprayed one of the um, tires on my Wagoneer because it had a white wall. And I, I told the guy that I sold it to. You're pathetic, dude. You're no better than the Negro corner car lot. You probably use an impact wrench on parts that need torque. They need a typical Jew in the state. But you, but you, but you. What a fucking retard. I ain't got time for it. Yeah, this guy's funny. He, You guys are the most ignorant people ever. He buys and sells these cars. You all expect an A-plus effort from him, and in the end, they look decent. That's the goal. Obviously, these are selling since he keeps doing them, idiots. And that's the thing. I'm not looking to put a show-quality finish on everything. Yeah, Nathan, the bolt-on hood lovers are because the cars will sit in the heat idling sometimes. Watch this. <laughs> Can't respond to him. Good friend. He's bought a car for me. Cannot respond no matter what I do. And he's telling me about the car. I wish I could respond to all his stuff, you know. This guy doesn't know shit when he sees it. So he videotapes it to show the shit he's trying to sell. These stupider than him. One owner car guy. Yeah, right. What an idiot. Now, there you go. Lift bags, not stock. Thank you. That's awesome, awesome stuff. Oh, look at this. Brent and Scooby got in a fight. It's kind of funny, too. See what happens when you wear sandals all the time? Like a girl. Smiley face. He's my friend. I know. Oh, does Nathan look like a fucking girl, you idiot? <laughs> Pretty brave behind your keyboard, huh, cunt? Mind your fucking business. I know both of you guys. I like you. You're good friends on here. I know you both. You and Brennan, he does not know you are fucking around. It's not obvious. Scooby Brennan is the guy that sent me the alien hat, blah, 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 blah. Busting my balls, and I just want everybody to get along, and we ended up talking, and everybody got along. So I'm definitely, definitely happy about that. Now, I'm sorry, but I've also got batteries going dead, and boom. Don't have to worry about that now. Pretty brave behind. I go right to cunt, too. I do. You cunt. Looks like a dope smuggler's video. Hmm, I don't know. It's a Border Patrol vehicle, so it's the one they caught him in. And dude, Thunder T-Bird, man, you're awesome. Tell me where the broken piece in the headlight was from a strobe and stuff. Thank you. That's awesome. First roundabout on this channel. I think it was. I don't think I drove one in. Um, I don't think there was a roundabout when I drove the car in Netherlands. He uses military time on his phone. And that's cool. I, I definitely am. Is crying, stupid? People don't like because I put up a video of the dog that's crying. That car is a piece of shit. The paint is faded. It runs like shit. A lemon, etc. Runs like shit. It doesn't mean lemon, by the way. You gave this Jordan wearing well. Oh, God. I'm not even going to repeat it. I'm a welfare. Yeah, rah, rah. a hard time for a car that's worth $100 max. I don't remember what car it was. Oh, it was my, um, Supercharged uh, Thunderbird uh, Anniversary Edition. You're an asshole to buy from and work for, Nate. The way you are, your business won't last much longer. Last fucking all my life. You're expressing your homosexual liberal ideas. My homosexual liberal ideas? <laughs> okay, I'm reading. This nigger likely needs this beater to move weight to feed his family, and you want to give him a hard time over a $100 beater. This guy's doing a job. This guy was a good. You're a total piece of shit, and your life is obviously a waste of space. $100. You obviously know nothing about cars and welfare driver. No, I'll bet that guy is many notches above you in life, even as challenged as he is. 
I wish upon you the worst possible sickness and strife available in this world. You racist piece of shit. You're obviously an inbred cunt. I don't think I'll see him again up here. I might. Not that he's run off because of that. He's a jackass. He'll be here forever probably watching my videos. Snoopy, thank you. That's awesome. I appreciate people throwing up my phone number and stuff for people. Quick like. No, it's not on the website yet. Uh, it will be soon. Very soon. M is for manual mode. Should have buttons on the shifter or back of the steering wheel to shift manually. Interesting. Very. Still a hack job on the bumper respray. What a fucking job. Next time, use the W140. I like that car, too. Eighty-eight thousand miles in five years is not low mileage. Forty thousand in five years are low mileage. Well, number one, it's seven, and number two, go fuck yourself. Yeah. <laughs> what am I gonna say? I don't know. It's a two thousand ten with eighty-eight thousand. It's in good shape. It has uh, not high miles, and I'm used to selling older stuff. Maybe it's. Not as low as I'm used to because it's a lot newer than I'm used to, but okay. Tell me about it, Rain Man. For fuck's sake. Weed killer would go a long way. And a carport. The size able to fit 30 cars out of the weather. Well, yeah, Joseph. Why don't you fucking kick me the $350,000 to build the carport? Your entire lot looks like crap. Seriously, dude. Looks abandoned. Uh -huh, yeah, Beavis. <coughs> oh, here's another one. One owner car guy. You're a piece of shit. Because I put a video painting a hood. You're a moronic cunt, as witnessed by your awful feet. Your mother the cunt, your trailer trash. So the waste so you're the waste of space. Oh, forgot you're a piece of shit. No, you said that. Someone needs to fuck you up already. Whenever you feel froggy, look, loser. You're not a tough, faggot. Come come and fucking show me up then, dude. Whatever. Replace oh, I talked about putting this in a the missing interior trim and tailgate is not going to be cheap. Would make a good work truck, but to be a nice family truck, nope. Okay, I know this gentleman. I don't dislike him. My answer, I tried to keep as nice as possible. And you have to understand, I'm advertising something. I'm selling something. I showed what it don't have. I don't need to talk about it and point it out and talk about how expensive it would be and say it wouldn't work for that. Sure to work for that. And you could put any kind of... My dad just was driving by the other day. He bought the seats for a 2012 Ford for 100 bucks. He had to take them out, which is easy. I said, dude, it has a door. No need for a tailgate. If you want a tailgate, then you will obviously buy one without a sit-down climbing shell on it. And no need for a rougher riding 2500 for a family there, champ. But hey, thanks for taking the time to try and rain on my parade. I don't mean to be mean, but I've just got done dealing with these comments and these comments. And there's a the thing. I'm dealing with people just fucking wanting to tell me everything about my life and how wrong and stupid I am. And if somebody comes along like this, but my point is I'm selling and I'm chill out, dude. You mentioned selling this show, but oh, I'm chill. Believe me, using YouTube as a sales tool is an interesting thing that I would be talking about it. And just I'm dealing with these other comments and I don't mean to be a dick. That's it. You speak in the video for cleaning tips from others that also keep up with the cars they sell and drive. Well, not really. Yet when I was scrolling down, I seen a lot of negative backlash. If you are easily offended and you're not uh, and easily offended, you are able to disable comments. Don't ask for tips. Really, I thought it was a decent video. I got past the fact you probably are some shady off the street seller trying to make a living. Uh, all right. Hey, wait, there's more. FYI, the only reason I came across this video, because a gentleman named Chris Fix did a video about cleaning his car. So yeah, check out his video, production value there. Oh no, I'm never offended. The more you like, dislike, comment, bitch and moan, and act entitled, the more I'm more nickels I make. I make more nickels, yeah. Chris Fix is a great for inept people like you. The homeowner Joe learns to wash his car crowd. Get a life, Jagoff. I detail cars that people like Chemical Brothers and Kiss Fix are never going to detail. It's not what they're doing. And it's just, this is a different thing. You're putting your best foot forward to sell your project car. I mean, you don't want to repaint it for the people. You're not even going to pay the right color. 
And that's the comments I'm dealing with. And I don't mean to be a dick to people sometimes that are nice people. I'm, I'm scrolling past the idiotic comments. You might find a new wife in one of them. They just want your money. That's on the last Facebook bitches. I said, well, shit, is that all they can have some of that? I got to make sure I've got everybody on here. I'm behind. We'll look soon. Nothing like the present. No time like the present. Boom. 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 Let's see what we got here. I don't, I know there's going to be big booty hoes and stuff. But now also, I've lost some people since this morning because I made a post that should have shook a few off. Let's see here. Six, two. No, man. Can't shake some people. Jeez. I tell you. Okay. Let's see who we got here. Whores, 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 whores. It's all whores, all whores. I need to erase these whores. If I missed your friend thingies, I'm sorry. This guy looks okay, looks okay, looks okay. See? Blaine Sullivan intuitive. Might be. Christ, Lauren. Uh, seeing people I know, sometimes I don't. Let on that quick, huh? Brian Suter is a mutual friend. Well, that's classic G Body Garage. But. Now, this chick's for real, I think. Kid on here. And she's got lots of posts. I think she's for real. I really do. I'm going to err on the side of. Now, this chick. I really don't believe this. if she is real, she's just a, she's just a hooter. Oh, boom, 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 boom. I think I just approved. What the, you know what? If they are in San Diego or somewhere where I say I have lived, there's a pretty good chance. You don't want to know them if they're like spammer. Okay, I think I got everyone here. No way. No way this chick is real. Well, now she might be real, but this is her profile picture. It's like, really? Ooh, she wants to be my friend? She has three whole friends. Delete request whore. Now, you know, I'm gonna, I would feel Marcus spam. I would feel awful. If there was a subscriber, especially a cute one, <laughs> 158 friends. Just because I've got friends don't mean shit. It means that there's a bunch of guys that are horny. That's what it means. That's about all it means. I'm friends with her. No way this chick is for real. No way. I bet you if I leave it, I'm going to get a thing that says, hey, what the hour are you doing? Okay. 
So what did that do to my friends list? That's 34 people. Well, Yannick, I'll answer that in a minute. I got to finish this video, Yannick. Yes, I still have the duster in Montana. You need to come get it. Yes, the internet is a minefield of bullshit for the unwary. I love how you're not afraid to call a cunt a cunt. The video is full of laughs. Keep it up. I am not afraid to call a cunt a cunt. Some guy beat the bag out of me. I was laughing. So that was pretty good. Yeah, I had to beat the bag out of some guy one time. I said, yeah, you think I really happened to you like that? I said, yeah, some guy chased the shit out of me and beat the bag out of me. 30 IQ points dumber from looking at him. Yep, you crack me up every time. Yep, that guy was just dumb looking motherfucker talking shit about me. This is called YouTube. Post videos of what you want. I swear these crybabies should have been left on their mother's butt cheek. I like you, dude. You're a good guy. Almost done. I know, John. feel like I can't troll you good enough to be featured in one of these videos. You're featured, but I will try anyways. Your beard is mediocre. Ha ha. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So far, this has been the smoothest process I've seen. If it could go as smooth as this every time, you'd be golden. No doubt. <laughs> so in other words, someone friendly with actual experience showed up instead of Barney shit stain. Just a thought. Having a powerful ATV quad would make it easier moving cars. I do okay with the cars moving cars, but yeah, that probably would. I use my Gator in Montana. You'll be getting Nigeria emails soon. You know that we found a lost bank account. Yeah, I get a lot of those. 3655. Oh my God, I lost it. That guy, this was the hardest I've laughed in a long time. You roasted that little bitch. I want to see. See what it is here. 3655. That guy wasn't. Right? What an idiot. No, no, not at all. That's just a fucking idiot fact. Just an idiot. There's a difference. It doesn't have to be racist because they're not racist or genderphobic or whatever the fuck it is. It's just. That's what we said. You fag. We said to your friends. It's just. That. Well, that is the stuff. Read the messages I sent you, please. Thank you. I try. I do try. This guy's a bum. I'm only 20, but I know this and I know that. I know, I know, I know about domain names and buy them frequently. Probably something you probably don't even know about. <laughs> I have 200 domain names. I'm not trying to fight you, Mr. Bum. You're not. Oh, well. I just don't believe that you're a millionaire when your fingernails look like you sleep by the freeway underpass. I don't care what you believe, you little fucker. Uh, no way you have money or else you wouldn't. <laughs> uh, it's not ever about, I've never, I never make a point of having or not having money. I have investments and I have things I do and I've done well at what I do. You probably will Google what a domain name is. Yeah. And look into buying a bunch of them. Yeah. I, yeah. What? I mean, what an entitled... Why, I called him entitled little idiot. Uh, he's making fun of me on this one here. He said something about Livewire. And I'm like, Livewire? Which one is that again? I can lose 30000 a month on stocks and be okay. And like, it's just... I, I That stock lost me a little bit of money. It made a lot of people money, if you sold. I got onto a consulting thing, and I held on, and got issued a... Oh, no, it's just... It's a mess for me. But it's one stock out of 200 and something. So, I mean, whatever. It's life, and I can lick my wounds and go on with it. But for somebody, and that's what it is, too. Somebody just blatantly wanted to call and talk shit about me, saying I'm an idiot because of something. I did say this. Snoopy, I know him. These fucking Mexicans, honey, I don't know what you're talking about. You're always swearing, you cocksucker. Dude, you're fucking nasty-ass cocksnack. <laughs> they get away with it anywhere they do. Mexican people get away with pinchy this and chinga this and wherever they go. They don't matter. If I talk like that in the middle of the mall, 
I do talk like that a little more. Everybody looks and just, oh my God, I can't believe you saying that. If they say it in Spanish, Spanish words, nah, everything's fine. Everything's all okay. Okay, Troll Patrol videos crack you up. Well, good, because here's another one. Your dad's Benz is awesome. It is awesome. He loves it. As a matter of fact, I'm going to refresh right here. Government wastes all the taxpayer. Yep, they ground up the light bars. Kenneth, I was even thinking if you had a little forklift to help you move, yeah? I think I did have a nice trailer. Okay, well, that's that. That's the videos. I'm going to get back to Facebook to doing what I need to do there and liking all those comments. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. I'll have other videos up every day. Check them out. Subscribe, like, comment. Thank you very much.